What's up guys? Maranatha Kuri here with Creators. We've seen the adverts for this application everywhere on the internet, on Facebook, on Twitter. So we decided what the heck, let's check it out. This is the Zoto mobile recharge application. And it's free to download on the Google Play Store. Like the name suggests, it's supposed to be an application that helps you recharge your phone faster and better than going out to buy a recharge card. On the app, we started out by registering our phone number with Zotto, along with our email address and name. And um, they sent us a verification number to verify that we're the ones. And we also received a one-time password. So Zotto has all this um, security things in place. In fact, if you look through the application, you see that this is something they take a lot of pride in. They have all this PSCI compliance things on almost every single page to let you know that it's a secure transaction. And this coupled with the design, they took time to design this application and I will give it to them. It's something that many Nigerian apps lack, but slowly, slowly, many more are beginning to do better. Now, having said that, the security part of the application may actually be the reason why no one will use this. Because in exchange for security, they take away convenience. And we'll see that as we go through the application. After all this setup, you're brought to this page with your phone number and your network. You can change the network there. Like in my case, I ported my number from Airtel to, um, no, from Glue to Airtel. So I changed it from the default Glow back to Airtel. Now the pet peeve or the bad thing about this is that you have to do that every single time you're reloading. I made a few mistakes as, as I was doing this over and over again. And once in a while I forgot to change it to Airtel and then it kept um, showing me errors. So you always have to remember that if you've ported your number. To make the payments for the recharge card, you will have two options. You could use Zoto Cash or your ATM card. With Zoto Cash, you can use your ATM card to load money from that card into your mobile wallet on the Zoto app. Now you can only use this loaded money to buy a recharge card. Another way you could actually get Zoto Cash is if you are given a bonus from the recharge cashback from the recharge that you've made previously. So after putting in the amount you want and choosing your method of payment, you could use secure payment over here and pick the card you would like to use. If you haven't put in any card yet, you enter a new card number. I like the way Zoto did this because the, the, the user experience was made to imitate what it would look like in real life. So in front here, you have the card number, you put it, it switches over to give you the, the three code number at the back you're supposed to put in. You do that, it takes you step by step by step rather than flooding you with too many things at the same time. So it makes the process easy. But at the end of the day, it refers you to MasterCard where you still have to get a, um, an OTP that's basically just a PIN number. You're also supposed to create another PIN for this Zoto application. After you do all of that, then you get whatever recharge that you applied for. Now, of course, you only do this once per card, so that makes it easy. You get an alert from Zoto and from your banks letting you know that your recharge was successful. You can come to this menu over here, go through your orders, you see the transactions, cards you've saved. You can change a lot of different things, including the pin. Check how much auto cash you have. This would be from your ATM card that you put in or directly from any cashback programs that you've earned from Zoto. Now it's a well-designed application, like I said before, very well-designed. But the question is, will I use it every day? This is an application I would used to replace buying a recharge card or some of my other applications? And the answer is no. And the reason is because whatever this does, uh, Diamond Bank and, and GTV, which I have connected to my phone already, do this like 10 times faster. With Diamond and GTV, I don't need to go through the steps of going through MasterCard or getting two OTPs, having two pins, just replicating the whole process. I don't need to do that. Within half the time I would use Zotto, I would already have my recharge card. So the process is just way too long. It's a well-designed app, but takes too long to load and takes too long 
to get your recharge so it's not the best option to use that's that's about it so that's it for zoto like comment we want to see your comments and want to see your feedback but like comment subscribe and create something see you next week